Hello World History students! Thanks for watching this video. Today we're going to discuss how art, music, and writing all changed as the effects of World War I swept the world. Millions had died in World War I from 1914 to 1918. Then from 1918 to 1919, an influenza epidemic which crossed six continents killed between 50 to 100 million people, even more deaths than the Great War. Because of the wealth of industrialization, the 20th century had started with so much optimism and confidence. But in less than 20 years, so many horrific incidences had occurred that everyone questioned the direction of human history. They asked, what next? Many artists, composers, and writers of this time communicated this uncertainty. Reality had become chaotic, so many artists believed that they should reflect the true reality of the world in shattered and broken images, bold colors, and strange shapes. These artistic movements were called Dadaism and Surrealism. Composers began to create music that rejected the classic examples and instead featured eerie, harsh, and wild rhythms and keys. Igor Stravinsky wrote The Rite of Spring, ballet music which was eerie, harsh, fierce, and wild, while Arnold Schoenberg wrote music that was atonal or without a key. Writers began to experiment with language and push the boundaries of storytelling with new literary forms. But also the writings of the time, both novels and poetry, often can be read as a response to the terrible uncertainties of the 20th century. William Butler Yeats wrote images that presented a dark vision of a chaotic world with little prospect of hope. He wrote, Things fall apart, the sinner cannot hold. Mere anarchy is loosed upon the world, the blood-dimmed tide is loosed, and everywhere the ceremony of innocence is drowned. The best lack all conviction, while the worst are full of passionate intensity. So this demonstrates how art, music, and writing during this time period reflected a hopeless and broken world after World War I. So thanks for watching this video.